channel guys so if you are new can you hit the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell for more future videos like this so in this short tutorial i want us to look at how to use sni bag host okay in three different ways okay so the first one you can use to create a normal ssh protocol file okay that's you use the remote proxy okay so you convert the host name to an ip address or you just use it like that okay then secondly you can use it in your your ssl file creation okay then thirdly you can use to create the v2 re file okay and i have tutorial on all these vpns all these vpn files uh, on my channel okay so i'll put the link in the description for you guys so let's go into it so let's go and get the this in our sni bag host so our usual website which it is one info xyz that's the new domain extension okay so you click on the first one so over here you click on bag host generator so when the page opens there you scroll down small then you come and click on select continent from there select select country then in africa so africa country scroll down ghana they click on generate okay so the bag host will be generated they just click on copy it's very simple you click on copy to copy it. so we have the teleservice so the vodafone we have this one so let's use this one for the tutorial okay click on copy good so with this proxy with this sni bag host you can just input it in your this in, input it as your remote proxy so let's use this particular vpn the zi vpn so let's use it Sorry. so this is the zi vpn so in order to use it let's reset it to the default state so you just come in check ssh proxy okay the moment you click on it the this thing will come so here you that you just input your this in the payload then here the remote proxy so this is where you push your you paste the this the sni bag host okay you click on it then you paste it okay and i so i have the I actually have the tutorial on how to create a ssh a vpn file for this particular one okay by converting the sni bag host to a remote proxy okay then also you can also use it to create the ssl file so if you want to create the ssl file you just come to this part okay you click on it then this is the sni the server name indication okay so this button this area you click on it to paste in the sni bag host okay after that you click on apply and I also have a tutorial on how to create this particular file. Okay, then we go to the v V2 read to V2 read. You paste the listing uh, on the website where you are going to create the account. Okay, so let's go there and let me show you how to go about it. So there, there is a special website called Fast SSH. Okay, so let's use the Fast SSH to create it. So. I have the list of SSH website that's on my listing so let's go and use it scroll down we have a list of them over here here at the top the girl scroll down we have the list down here so this is the site that we normally use to create the v2ray the v2ray files so this is the first ssh so click on it to go to their web page
so over here you zoom you scroll down small then you come to the v2 ray this is the v2 ray service you click on it okay close the ad okay so after clicking on the v2 re service you scroll down so you have the service in the uh, locations so the first one is the first one is the usa early which is lost and the other one is virginia okay so you have a lot of them over here do so you click on any of them that you want to create the v2 re from so let's use this one i think there is space you click on create v2 re account so I want to show you how to use the SNI bag host in creating the V2V. Okay, do I have a tutorial on it? So here you just check I'm not a robot. Then you come in, input the username. Then here you type in the SNI bag host. I'm not a robot. Then the SNI bag host. No, sorry, the username, the username. Let's type anything. Then the SNI bar goes, you put it here. Okay. And you type in there. Then you come and check this very very one. Reverse SNI bag or reverse SNI. Okay, so we check it. If you don't check it, there's no way you'll be able to create it. After then, after checking all this, then you come and click on create. Okay. And so these are the three simple ways of using SNI bar goes. So like I said, I have tutorial on. How to create file for all these three methods okay here is how to use this in the bible it's very simple so stay connected to my channel for more updates like this thank you